What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Drew Easy. Welcome to another edition of Joy Easy Delivers. My longtime viewers, welcome back for my new viewers. Welcome to the channel. Okay, today is Monday, March 13, and it is a new week to make our dreams become a reality. It is a new week to make it happen for ourselves, for our family, and for our close friends, guys. Let's get up. It is a new week. If you had a rough week last week, let's brush our shoulders off. Brush, 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 brush your shoulders off. So brush it off, guys. Have, uh, let's move forward with a positive mindset because that's the only way to move forward because if we're always negative and always like complaining about life and becoming the victim and this and that we are not going to move forward we're not going to make our dreams become a reality so we have to have it in our minds that we are strong enough to make our dreams become a reality we are strong enough to move forward to make as much money as possible to make our dreams come true guys we can all do it guys we all have the power in here in here the power to do it maybe we're not financially ready to do it but we have that grind mentality that grind mindset guys well we can do it i believe in every single one of you guys now today is monday in case you guys didn't know um last week we made 700 dollars. we did not work on sunday because i i wanted to hang out with some family and i did a video on basically the whole doordash earned by time but we made 700 bucks last week i am going to start letting you guys know how much i have made uh, on, on the Monday videos, I'll let you know how much I made for the for last week, and then no, I'll do that on a I'll do that eventually, either on the Monday video or on a Sunday video, and then also I'm gonna give you guys how much I have made for the month, and I'm gonna have I'm gonna tell you guys how much I've made for the year so far, um, using the the app that I'm building. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start like little by little trickling in, like showing how much I made and this and that using my app. So I'm kind of like using marketing like kind of like an indirect marketing strategy where I'm like not telling you download the app but I'm, I'm kind of like you know indirectly telling you to download the app by showing you like my earnings and this and that but I have not inputted all my earnings yet I uh, already inputted Instacart Uber Eats and I have to do DoorDash and ship that shouldn't take too long and after I do that I will get I let you guys know how much I've made for the week for the month for the year I have an average average how much I made for the day average for the Daily average for the week, daily average for the month, and I'm gonna do daily, ad oh, I have the daily average for the year. And little by little, I'm gonna be adding more and more things, you know, also if I get some feedback, like, hey, Juizy, why don't you add this? Then I'll add it too. But you know, for now, I'm just kind of like putting on the app whatever I have in mind, I guess. But as people are telling me, hey, Juizy, I, I, I need this number or I need that number. I need to know how much I made or how much I spent or how much I did this and how much, you know, stuff like that. But for now, I'm gonna be doing that. But, okay, that's enough. I'm not gonna make this intro any long. We're gonna get the grind started. I already went to the gym. Don't forget to smash that like button to help me blow up in the YouTube world. And if you like the video at the end and you wanna watch future videos of me doing deliveries, just subscribe. All my people, like I said, I went to the gym already. So I don't have my Zoe Energy. I don't have my C4. I have to drink a bank today. There is no C4 anywhere anymore. I'm gonna have to buy it on Amazon now. I'm gonna have to go to Amazon and buy the Zoe Energy because I cannot find it in any stores, but it's all good. Oh, the strategy is shipped, Instacart, DoorDash, Uber Eats, and I might take a break in between, in between to work on the app. So with all that being said, let's get the grind started. Let's go. The time is 10.06 in the morning and we accepted our first order, orders of the day, orders, plural. All right, we accepted two prescription shipped CVS orders for $7 each, that's $14. And we also accepted an in, uh, do it 11 to 12. And we also accepted an Instacart order, which we are going to do after we pick up the prescriptions. So we're gonna do the prescriptions, right? Uh, and then leave it in the car, go do the shipped order, I mean the Instacart order, it's a $13 order for eight items, guys. Milam's Market. So it's one of those things that it doesn't have the aisles and it's always like, it's not an easy place to navigate. And they don't have the maps. They have the maps for everywhere else, but the place that needs it. But it's okay. It, I saw the items. The items aren't that bad. It's just uh, some produce and then like some Coke. It doesn't look like hard items to get, guys. So it shouldn't be hard. $13, eight items. And then fourteen dollars, the two shipped orders, order orders, the day to start off the day, guys. Let's get the grind started. 
Let's go. Oh, also, okay, I'll tell you later. Let's go. Okay, we made it to CVS to pick up the two prescription orders. And then after that, the Milam's Market is over there somewhere. It's just a quick drive over there. But let's go get this first. Okay, we got one of the prescriptions. The other one, it says that they don't have it, that it could be the wrong one. But I remember seeing both addresses were the same. So it has to be this. But the thing with shipped is that it, once you mark that you arrive to the store, it doesn't say like, it doesn't show you the address of the CVS. Why, do, why, does, why, why does that happen? Like, you could see the address on CVS until you mark that you arrived at the store and then you can't see it. I don't know why they do that, man. That's like that's kind of that's kind of dumb, right? But whatever. Let me let me see if I can go to the other CVS. Maybe it could be there. I don't know, but uh, maybe maybe I made a mistake and I'm not perfect. But I I could have sworn I saw both both the same CVS address. So we'll see. All right, guys. So I figured it out. I mean, it was it is a different store. I figured out how to find the address. So it's more up north, which I mean down south. But it, be quiet. Oh, I can't get I can't get copyrighted with this. I was watching, listening to sports radio. Supposedly the Dolphins got Jalen Ramsey. Look, anybody that goes to Miami, the Miami Dolphins, the career dies. And then when they go somewhere else, the career resurrects. So you could have the best all-star team in Miami, the Miami Dolphins. They're going to lose no matter what. So it's okay. I'm not happy about them getting Jalen Ramsey because I know he's going to come over here. He's probably, I think he's been getting injured. He's probably going to come over here, live the Miami life. Go to the club, go to the Miami beach, and go to the, the clubs and all that stuff. Live the Miami life, not get re any recovery. He's not going to recover. He's going to stay out all night. And, you know, he's going to get injured because that's just what happens in Miami. People forget their careers, their athletic careers when they come to Miami. Unless you're like, unless you're real serious, unless you're like LeBron James, for example. Uh, Dwayne Wade. Uh, who else? Right now, Tyreek Hill. He's a he's a beast. He takes his 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 game serious. He doesn't go out to the club and all that stuff. Or he probably maybe does, but he he knows how to recover himself, his body. Okay, well, why me? Why are we talking about sports? Let's go to Milan's Market and get the Milan's Market order. Let's go. All right. So the CVS customer's address is literally, like literally, on the way to the other CVS. So we're gonna go do this Milan's market. We gotta deliver it though, which is not good because I have to go a different direction. It's okay, guys. I think we'll, we'll be able to manage. Let's go. Okay, we made it to Milan's market. Let's go get these eight items. Wish me luck. Yes, yes, I could have parked here. I know, I know, but I, I didn't even see this until now. All right, the first item is just a bag of yellow onion. Um, yeah, right here. So this is well, the last one too. Yellow onions. Second item is uh, these green scallions. Okay, this third item is the goodness, goodness Gardens Mint. It's probably over here somewhere. I think this is it right here. But look, look at the, look, look at the pictures, guys. I don't know why they don't just put this in the picture. But let's see if it is. Yeah, this is it. So you guys see this pasta right here? Look, this this pasta here. Okay, for for the professional or the the experienced shoppers, you know that this is usually in the cold section, right? But you normally like with a with a deli, not the deli, the the milk and stuff like that. But this thing says it was in the pasta section. I don't know why it says pasta. It's not in the pasta section. Instacart. So now I know I have to go somewhere else. But at least I know. Next year, next item is right here, which is a, some Diet 5 Ocean Spray. I think this is it, my people. Yeah, this is it. Will you look at here, my people? The Zoa Energy is here in Milan's Market. Okay. These are the Black Adam ones. So this is probably old. They're trying to sell it. I'm going to come back for this. I'm going to come back for this. So we need two of these, and they only have... Oh, no, they do have two. Citrus right here. Oh wow, okay. The last two. Now we gotta get some, uh, oh no, this is mini, mini Coke Zeros. Where's it at, right here? Okay, one of these. All right, we got this Rana thingy matriga here. We need the main lobster. And we got it. 
I knew it, man. I knew it was gonna be here. Okay, we're done. This is the last item. Okay, it's been 11 minutes and we are done. This is what we have right here. If this was if this was Publix, I would have done this in in probably five minutes. I don't know. I think I don't know. Who knows? The thing is that this thing, I kind of I knew it was here, but then I'm like, no, maybe it says in the cheese section. And then I I went against my intuition. I went to the cheese section. It wasn't there. And then I came back here. It was here. And this, that's it. That's pretty much it. All right, let's go pay for this and deliver. Guys, I haven't showed you, and I kind of probably haven't seen our people, our family. What's up? I haven't seen you guys in a while, man. How you doing? How the kids? Kids are good? Okay, all right, have a good one. There's a car behind me. Guys, let's actually drop off the prescription that we have now. It's actually not, not far away from, from where I'm at. So let's just do that. It's like a mile away from here. So that's good. Let's go. Okay, we made it to the CVS to get the other 11 to 12 order. The prescription, it is 11.20. So it's 11.20. We have a long time, a lot of time to complete it. I think it's like a mile away from here. All right, we got the prescription. And we actually accepted an Instacart order, Publix, in this right there. Publix, two items, guys. So we're gonna do it real quick. Nine dollar order for two items. Let's go get the Instacart Publix. Let's go. Okay, Publix. Let's go get this quick. The prescription is due at twelve o'clock. It's eleven twenty-five p.m. So this can't take us more than ten minutes. If not, then we're in trouble. The bad thing about the store is that it's so it's big, so most of the time it's gonna be just us walking. Okay, first item, uh, this is it, 16 ounce. Five of these? No, this is not it. Uh, it's the smaller one, I think. This one. No, this one. This is it, right? What am I looking for? Mini chocolate chip right here. Five of these. Wow, the last five. We literally got the last five. I got lucky. Last item, this canola oil, but the smaller one. Where's the small one? Where's the small one, guys? Okay, they don't have the the smaller canola oil, so I'm just gonna give them the, the bigger one, right? Hold on, let me see. Yeah, they don't have it, guys. They don't have the small one. So I'm just gonna give them the big one. It has been three minutes and we are done, ladies and gentlemen. This is all we have. It took us three minutes. Now we are good, guys. We'll, we will be able to deliver both the prescription order and this Publix. Let's deliver the Publix first and then deliver the prescription. And then we accepted another prescription order to be due from 12 to 1. And I think we'll have time to maybe do a food delivery if they offer us anything. We'll see. I don't know. All right, but let's go pay for this, though, and deliver. Oh, my goodness, guys. They have it right here. Let me let me replace it. Let, let me say that I found the original item. All right, perfect. So we're good. Bro, you're not gonna believe it, or maybe you will believe it. Like, yeah, you would do that, Joezy. I left my wallet in the car. I was about to pay, and I'm like, oh my goodness. But good thing I I was in the self checkout. I was in in the actual line. Man. Uh oh, the gang is here. The gang is here across the street. What's up, my peeps? You guys are good. Oh. Uh, no, no. Okay, we made it to CVS. It is 12:11. This is due from 12 to 1, so we have more than enough time. We haven't accepted any other orders for any other app, but we are looking. We are waiting. All right, we got the prescription. Let us deliver. We're, we're waiting for another order, man. We're not getting anything yet, but it's all good. All right, the time is 1.14 p.m. and we were waiting a long time, guys. I don't know what happened. What happened? Life happened. Gig life happened. It's slow, it's busy, it's slow, it's busy, it's slow, it's busy. That's what happened. I mean, I can't be ex trying to explain what's happening. It's just it's not the way it is, but we accepted something. 1.14 p.m. We accepted a $14 Uber Eats order for 6.9 miles. So it's a lot of miles, guys, and it's two customers. But they're both in the same restaurant, which is good. Let's go get it. Let's move these wheels. Okay, we made it to the restaurant. The place is called Sweet Green. They are usually always ready, so let's see if they are ready. I don't know. Let's see. 
actually also want this one, one of them. So, perfect, they're both it. Let's go. Thank you. Alright, we got both orders. So we're good to go. The time is 2.22 p.m. and we accepted a Panera Bread Uber Eats order for $5, 2.6 miles. I was right next to the restaurant, so I'm like, ah, and it's been slow for this whole afternoon, uh, the whole afternoon for some reason. I want to mean for some reason. It's just, it's just a bit, that's what it is. I mean. Hey, gracias. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, we got the order guys, it was ready. I was kind of scared that it wasn't ready, but it is. Alright, let's go deliver. Let's do it. This is so funny guys. This is so funny. My luck is like the best. I was supposed to go, this is, my, my customer's house is supposed to be right there. Right there. And, and the road is closed, but I'm walking. I'm walking over there, I don't really care. Okay, so I am walking. I'm not gonna, I mean, I have no other choice anyway, so. Let's go. I feel like this whole this whole neighborhood is under construction for some reason. I don't know why. The time is 2.42 p.m. and we accepted a Starbucks order. Uh, Uber Eats, $5 for 2.5 miles. So basically the same, the same type of order. Put them over here, Armando. Okay, we got it. All right, let's go. All right, we got it, guys. Let's deliver. Hey, how are you? Good. Appreciate it. Okay, the time is 5 10 p.m., and we were able to accept while I was working on the app uh, two shipped orders. So I was like, you know what? Let's do it. One is due, it's not due till 11 p.m., and the other one is due 6 to 7. So it's an Office Max, $7 order, and it's going towards the direction of the CVS so it's a CVS $7 order ship uh, and then a uh, office max $7 order the office max delivery is gonna go to where the CVS delivery is so it's gonna be perfect let's go get it so it's gonna be a $14 order for shipped let's go get it okay so we made it to office max office depot office whatever you want to call it today and uh, let's go pick up the stuff hopefully it's nothing huge hopefully it's not an office table Last time they told me just to come over here and get it. So let's do that. This is hard. I gotta go by the order number, I guess. 34001. All right, my people, we got the order. It is all this stuff. What do you guys think? We gotta deliver this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That happened. Okay, at least it's not an office table. Okay, so everything fit nice and perfectly here. Everything fit perfectly, everything fits. You already see it here. The only thing is that, I wanna know what this is. Packing peanuts? Oh, this is like, yeah, I know what this is. Packing peanuts, okay? We got three of these. Now let's go to CVS. De la oficina. Mm -hmm. La oficina. Sí, Aquí. Aunque sí. es eh, delivery. Para una foto. Rapidito. Okay, the time is six o'clock and we accepted a CVS Instacart order for two items. Eight dollars for two items. And remember, we still have to pick up the uh, whatchamacallit order, the shipped order, seven dollar order. So we're basically gonna pick up the CVS seven dollar order and then do a eight dollar CVS order for two items that's it and normally i probably wouldn't get it if it was like uh i usually get it if it's nine dollars not eight but i'm already here anyway so why not make an extra eight bucks for two items and the items look pretty easy okay the first item is this deodorant here i'm actually surprised we found it oh no well we didn't find it wow what a surprise what a surprise which one is it cool wave this is cool wave four ounce was this this is 2.8 ounce oh they want the bigger one 
and they don't have it they don't have the two four point the four ounce look i'm just gonna give them the 2.8 ounce call it a day and that is it hold on i just want to make sure that this is the correct thing look clear shield cool wave clear gel so this is it guys it's just that it's a different size because look they the this is where the bigger size is but they don't have it the last item I'm assuming is this brush. Let me see. This is not it. Man, we keep getting the wrong items. Oh, it's probably the smaller one. It's probably one of these. Yeah, we are done, guys. It has been three and a half minutes and we are done. It's just these two items. Let's go pay for this, get the CVS order, and then start delivery. Let's go. Oh, CVS? Okay, the time is 6.45 p.m. And we accepted five CVS prescription orders. There's like two in one store. No, two in one store, two in another store, and one in a different store. I blind accepted it, guys, because I was happy. I don't know why. So I accepted it. I don't know if they're far away from the CVS. I know where the CVSs are. I just don't know if the house is close or not <clears throat> because there are some CVS orders that for some reason their CVS is like super far from their house. It could be that the customer put the wrong address or they put it, something happened. So it could be one of these orders. I'm not sure, but we're going to do them. So we are going to do these orders. Hopefully we get, it's not due until 11, none of them. So let's see if we could do, see if we, let's, let's test our, multi-apping skills but we made it to one of the cvs's let's get this one order we'll go to another cvs and then and go get that one and then see what happens how about that how about we just go with the flow let's go okay we made it to the first cvs okay that the delivery address for this customer is on the way to the other cvs so we could go to the other cvs after picking this up get the other order and i think the the other delivery address is like close by so i think the the route and the navigation is gonna go perfectly with these two orders, so let's go. I'm still looking for Instacart orders, but we got the $7 shop only for 31 items. Okay, we got the shipped order, and uh, I just realized that I have to be careful with these orders that they start offering me, like a lot in a row. A lot. It could mean that maybe people canceled it because the pharmacy's closed. That happened. Okay, we made it to the second CVS. Let's go get this prescription. All right, guys. So I'm gonna, I had to cancel the order because they said, like, they had the order, but they said that they had no credit card on file, so they can't really release it, or it's not, it's not showing as a shipped order in their system, the pharmacy. And I called them, and I'm like, hey, they said that they can't release it because they don't have like a credit card on file or whatever and it's like oh okay so all right we're gonna cancel it for you the time is 7 21 p.m look it's still it's still light outside it's not dark because the one hour later did you guys notice i didn't know about the hour until i didn't even know okay that that's the time 7 22 we accepted an instacart order ten dollar instacart order for a petco man every time i pass by that petco they always bless me with a good order it's usually a thirty dollar order but this one's a ten dollar but for one item that's it let's go get it let's go okay my people we made it to petco let's go get this ten dollar order for one measly item oh i have to So we need this thing called the Taste of the Wild. I'm just gonna go through every aisle. Look, this thing is, it usually, these Peckles, they're supposed to have the name of the brand up there, if you can see it, but they, I don't think they update those, those little signs. So it could be, it could be anywhere, you know? I have to, I have to go through every single aisle. Have you guys done any uh, Peckle orders? Let me know in the comments. If you've done any or, have you met or you don't you've never done it or you've never seen it before or or you don't have any pet clothes around your area okay we found the food ladies and gentlemen right here it is 28 pounds 28 pounds uh, good thing i go to the gym right uh, which one is it is it this one 
No, it's the high perine or whatever. I think this is it. Right here. Okay, it's been four minutes and we are done. That's it, the bag is secured. Let's go pay for this and deliver. What do we have here? Oh, there's nothing here. What do we have here? We don't have anything here either? Wow, okay. That's kinda nothing here either. Oh, look, there's a snake right there. Oh, so these are snakes. They're probably hidden somewhere. But look, that's a snake right there. goodness it's gonna bite you guys be careful don't let it bite you yes guys yes i don't agree that they should have these animals here they should leave them in the wild i know i feel the same way man so but i mean it's just a way of of capitalism right there that's capitalism at its finest guys check out this house being built right here it's gonna be my house um it's gonna be my house actually i forgot to tell you guys that i i I became a millionaire finally and I was able to buy this house they're making it now and I'm gonna live in it I think so they're supposed to be done by the end of the year so we should be moving in soon and I'm gonna start uh, live streaming and that's gonna be one of my live streaming rooms all right and then this is gonna be my neighbor whoever this is and yeah guys that's pretty much my future Alright ladies and gentlemen, if you made it to the end of this video, thank you for watching. Alright, this is how much we made for the day. On this car we made $40.76, on Uber Eats we made $43.06, and on Ship we made $51.80 for a total of $135.62. Guys, I'm not gonna lie to you, I have no idea, I forgot about this whole shift. It's already the next day at the end of the, or close to the end of the next day. I didn't even record the ending video because I woke up the next day from this video, the next day with, without even doing the intro and going straight to work. I started working super early. So stay tuned for that next video to check it out. It's gonna be pretty cool. I start super early and it's already four o'clock and I'm already, I already met my goal at four o'clock. So stay tuned for that next one. So I, but, so I don't know what to say in this ending video because I forgot what happened. I mean, we made forty dollars on Instacart. We made forty-three on Uber Eats. On Ship, we made fifty-one bucks. We made a lot of money on Ship. I have no idea. I have no idea. It's like it's like this day never happened because it's already the next day, and I don't even know. So you know what? We're gonna end the ending right here. Stay tuned on that next video. But if you made it to the end of this journey, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button to help me blow up in the YouTube world. And if you like this video, at the no, it's already the end. You see, if you like this video and you want to watch 50 videos of me doing delivery, just subscribe on my people. My people, have a good one, guys. My head already hurts. Have a good day. I hope you guys are grinding out there. It's your boy, Joe Easy. Let's go.